There are some parents in Pearland very upset over how the school district disciplined some cheerleaders. Some Dawson High School cheerleaders were caught smoking e-cigarettes, but their parents say how they were punished is extreme compared to how other student athletes have been treated. Levi Ismail has both sides tonight. The expectation has always been, at least for these parents, that the crime fits the punishment. Unfortunately, that's not what we've come to learn is the case. Kermit's daughter is one of eight Dawson High School cheerleaders kicked off the squad back in January and banned for a year. They also got two day suspensions and 60 days in the Alternative Learning Academy. Their crime? She was uh, caught with some other girls uh, at a cheer event with a, a jewel, an e-cigarette. You won't find excuses here for what happened, just questions. Why is there a mandatory um, expulsion from that team? You know, and if it's a good idea for them, why is it not a good idea for kids on other teams? Mainly because most Pearland ISD teams don't have one of these, a handbook of expectations and punishments for breaking the rules. For Kermit, it's you a know, clear we, double standard. Uh, that, that's probably the elephant in the room, right? You know, you've got kids on revenue producing sports that apparently come in and out of, uh, of these situations, and um, it's not the case with cheerleaders. Uh, you read into that what you will. Pearland ISD tells us, quote, sponsors and coaches of extracurricular activities may develop and enforce standards of behavior that are higher than the district developed student code of conduct. It took two appeals to get the one year ban lifted for the underclassmen, but for Kermit's daughter, a senior, they have one more appeal they're fighting for. All we're asking for is put her back on the team. You know, let her, let her go back to her team like every other kid in every other sport. And, uh, and graduate a cheerleader. At this point, they're holding out hope with seven weeks to go before graduation. In Pearland, Levi's Mail, KHOU 11 News.